walking back to the car for Best Buy. Got a uh, one of these memory card things because I lost my cable for this camera, so I'm gonna give this thing a try. Twenty twenty-five dollars better than driving to Atlanta and getting one, so uh, we'll see how it does. Alright, I got very little memory on this, uh, so I'm going to do this quick. This is what came in the box, was the memory card reader. Sorry for the low lighting right here, I'm going to try to... Okay, we got the uh, card that goes in the camera and the cable that came with the card reader. Go over here, plug it into the computer, plug the other end into... And it's gonna install the driver. Your device is ready to use. Okay. I have plugged the device into the card reader. I mean, the uh, card into the card reader. And here are all the files. And all the pictures. And something went crazy. Okay, there it is. Alright. Where's my list? There it is. Uh, things I liked about it, things I did not like about it. Um, thing I like about it was it was fast, not slow. It was easy to use. Just plug it in, pops up on the screen. There's your files. Um, compatibility, I've used this on Windows 7, Windows Vista, and Windows XP. I have not used this on Macintosh, Linux, or anything else. Just on those three that I mentioned. First three. Um, and the setup. Setup was really easy as you saw earlier in this video. Um, portability. Uh, it's portable. You can put it in your pocket and it's not really that big of a deal. Um, things I didn't like about it. It's one more thing in your bag. You know, I know people, a lot of people, when they travel, they don't like having one more thing in their bag, having to deal with it through security or whatever. Um, another thing I didn't like about it is it's not wireless. Oh, it's got one wire on it, big deal. But, um, and it's uh, also not scratch proof. I kind of made those last two up. It's not really that big of a deal. But uh, yeah, I'd recommend this to uh, anybody that's looking for a good card reader. Rock band. <laughs> there you go. I don't have a rating scale right now, but if I did, I'd give it a 5 out of 5. Wow. First review, got a 5 out of 5.